this is your unlucky day, Gus. You have no idea what you're doing. Yes, and you can quote me on that. Hey there, gorgeous. How are you? What's the matter? What you got there? Research for my next book, excuse me. Wait, 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 wait. Why such a chilly response? You're so warm to me back in the hotel room. Um, Gus, you have to get over yourself. Yeah. Well, you missed the show. Danny got up on the stand and he dug his own grave and he jumped right in it. You should have seen it. It's beautiful. We'll see about that. Mistakes, not crimes. What then? Hi. Have I got a surprise for you? Well, it's going to have to wait. We've got a crisis on our hands here. I'm going to have to call Michelle earlier than I wanted to, and I have to prep her for her testimony. Ross, you need to see this. Ross, Ross, I have to talk to you. Did you find Michelle? Oh, no, I look everywhere. I think she must have left the building. How could she leave the building? She's my next witness, my only oh, witness. She knows she's up next. Well, Danny, we got to get her back here. I need every minute to go Calling over her, her testimony right now. Perhaps Michelle's testimony isn't as important as you think. It is if I want to keep Danny out of prison. I'm trying to tell you something here. And I'm trying to tell you that we have a crisis situation. And Russ, remember the other If night. you want to help me, find Michelle, please. Ray. Hey. Hey. So have you seen Michelle? Yeah. Anywhere? Why? Where? You did? Where? Uh, on my way here. She was traveling in the opposite direction on 5th, so I waved to her. 5th Street. Didn't... Where yeah. the hell is she going? Is there a problem? Yeah, Michelle's supposed to be here, ready to testify oh, as man. soon as the recess is over. Listen, will you do me a huge favor? No problem. And I'll just, find her. All right, I'll try the Bauer House and, uh, I don't know, anything okay. in between. Okay, it. What the hell is she out there driving around for? It doesn't make any sense. lately. Come on, Michelle. What are you up to now? Answering. I'll try someplace else. We need her back. I'm gonna call Maida, maybe she wants to check on Robbie or something. I don't know. Maida, stand. Uh, this Ross, I realize you're, you're in a, a limbo until you're I'm not in limbo. Shot, right? I'm in legal hell, and so is Danny. Ross, I found but, something. Like but is it a witness? Is it somebody I can put on the stand in case Michelle never does show up? No, it's not. Look, Blake, all I need is a witness. Everything else has to wait. I'm sorry. There you are. How much longer is this damn recess? What's going on? It goes on for a while yet. Why? Kind of hard to miss these days. You look great. Blake tells me you're feeling well. Is everything okay? Yeah, yeah. On the baby front, it, work is another story. Speaking of which, I'm late, so if you will excuse oh, me. Let me please ask you. You know I just love Rick. How is he? He must be overjoyed with the baby, but it must be such a strain. Philip. How did you find out? Did Blake tell you? No, no. I overheard Buzz and Frank eavesdropping. Reporters have it. Holly, this, this is not for public consumption. Oh, absolutely not. But Philip knows. Yes, Rick and I told him together. I can't remember a time when they weren't best friends. But Rick is a wonderful guy, and I know he will do everything possible to make you and the baby happy. Well, you know what he can do? He could leave me alone with all the other men in my life. My father, mm. Frank... Rick, Philip, all of them want to put their two cents in every chance they get convinced that they, and only they, truly know what's best for me. Mm. They are a willful group, but very well-meaning. Yes, but if they keep interfering, I may just clear out a dodge, uh, crawl up some mountain oh, hey, I'm and... glad I caught you. I could... Hi. 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 Oh, uh, 
I ordered these for you. Um, Catalogs yeah. of baby yeah, products. Th th tons of great stuff in them. I have all the stuff I need from Zach. Yeah, yeah, oh. I, I know it's from Stephen. You don't want hand-me-downs. You want him to be his, his own stuff. I mean, this is all state-of-the-art things in here. <laughs> this is, like, you know, like carriages, car seats, boppies, breast uh, pumps. <laughs> breast pumps. Boppies. <laughs> Thank you, but no thank you. You don't want them. Pop. Pop. Oh, pop. What's that for? I love you. I love how much you want to take care of me and take care of this baby, but uh, you are driving me crazy. You and Frank and Rick and Philip. I don't need to be catered to or coddled. I have always been the first person that I turn to when I need something, and lugging this little guy around with me doesn't change anything. If you ask me, independence is sorely overrated. Okay, I... you have a restaurant to run, you have kids over in England to worry about, you have women to court. Get on with your own life and let me get on with mine, please. And right now, I have to be in court, so goodbye. Well, how, how long are you gonna go on working? Oh, till five or six. Uh, no, I, in general, I mean, if you considered, you know, maternity leave. Do you have some chalk? Why? Right? Harley's fine up on the specials board, and that way, no one will miss it. Hey, Coop. Hi. Where are you headed off to? Guys. <sighs> Be seated, bailiff. All right, I really have to talk to you. Hey, we're in session, not now. This is important. This is about Gus. Gus, he's the last person I care about. Gus, you should care about. Listen, I Mr. Do... Marler, do you and your lady friend wish to share something with the court? Uh, no, Your Honor. Thank you. We'll discuss this later. Okay. Thank you. That was Ray. He, he, he uh, no sign of really. Can't find what really? Well, the only thing we can do, Danny, is stall. Your Honor, Mr. Marler. You know, the shortened recess has uh, taken the defense somewhat unawares, and I know the jury has been called back, but if we could extend this break by the 20 minutes that was previously... The recess is a privilege, Mr. Marler, not a right. The prosecution made a request, and I granted it. The court is ready to proceed. Please call your next witness.